Okay. Oh, hey! I think we're live! What's up, Facebook? It's Philippa Sue. Um, just here to chat with y'all, waiting for your comments. Um, I'll tell you right now, it's uh, 5.30 on a Friday. We've got a show tonight. It's pretty stunning. Oh, there's one person. Hello, Adrian. You're the first person. Congratulations. Hi, 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 hi. Hey, everybody. Let me know if you guys have any questions. Um, how are you doing? Maria says. I'm doing really well. Um, in what ways do you relate to Eliza? I feel like it's like a cycle. Sometimes I feel like I learn things from Eliza, and then sometimes I feel like Eliza learns things from Philippa. So it kind of goes hand in hand. Um, Emma's from Montreal. Hi, Emma. Um, let's see. What song do you sing the most at home? Um, recently I've, singing, I've been singing a lot of the Robert Bridegroom because my fiance is in the Robert Bridegroom and I love that music. It's great. Um, how is Lynn? He's doing great. I just saw him. Um, let's see. Oh, hello from Spain. Oh, my eyeliner. Okay, so someone just commented on my eyeliner. You guys, this is not my everyday makeup. I had a photo shoot this morning. I don't want you to think that I just happen to like know how to do this. I really don't. Um, oh, the soup can. See this? Someone made this for me. I don't know who, but we love it. Thank you if you're out there watching. Um, best piece of advice you've ever gotten about musical theater and auditioning? Uh, I feel like the best advice I ever got was to um, how to build my audition book, um, which was to make sure that I knew all of my songs and to have little um, kind of like leaflets in them so that I can turn the pages really easily so I can find my songs. It was really helpful. Um, also to have a table of contents in your music book. Um, let's see. Uh, uh, uh. Hi from California, hello. Okay, Taylor asked if you have a great question. I think it would be, wait for it. It's a great song. It makes me cry every time I listen to it. Um, yeah. Quick shout out to Tina. Hello, Tina. What's my favorite part of portraying Eliza? I think, I think it's the journey that she takes. Um, she lives to be 97 years old, and that's a lot of time to live, let alone portray that in a play. Hello, Stephanie from Florida. Who was your main inspiration? Growing up, I feel like um, Julie Andrews was a huge inspiration for me. I feel like I learned how to sing because of her. Let's see. If you could be any other character in Hamilton, who would it be? Hercules Mulligan! Favorite costume would have to be, um, I love the maternity outfit, which is kind of crazy, but um, it's so beautiful. And I also love my white dress in act two because it's really comfortable. Any incidents with the fire doing burn? No! I feel like there were a couple of times that um, the fire didn't quite catch and so the letter just kind of like went out but no no crazy incidents let's see how's my garden going cat just asked about my garden thanks cat it's going great my radishes have been eaten by the birds unfortunately so no radishes but herbs lettuce kale it's all going great actors who want to make it to Broadway what's my advice from Samantha um, well I feel like if you just keep following your gut, be in those rooms that you want to be in and create the art that you want to create. Um, it may not take you to necessarily Broadway, but it will take you to the best places in the world um, with the best people. Rebecca asks, any tips for girls who would go to theater auditions and sing Burn? I feel like Burn, um, it took a lot of work to try <clears throat> and not make Burn too pushed. So if anything, I feel like um, don't push too hard because it, it, you know, it can get pretty emotional. But if you keep it just simmering under under the lid, it's it's it's, uh, it's better that way. 
Um, hmm. Let's see. Gosh, these questions are coming so fast. Oh, Carly, how was my birthday? Um, my birthday was great. Thanks, Carly. I went to ABC Kitchen and I had some delicious ricotta stuffed ravioli. Carolyn Cox asks, my favorite animal. My favorite animal is probably the panda bear. Um, thank you, Maria. Helpless is a very good song. Let's see. <laughs> some belated birthday wishes. Dream roll. Ooh, I would love to play um, Dot in um, in um, Sunday in the Park. That would be amazing. Favorite food? Uh, lot, I mean, I'm like such a foodie. I love all kinds of foods. Um, I think it probably would have to be cheese. I think. Not sure. <laughs> um, Let's see, what cast member do I hang around with most often? Um, I hang out with everybody a great deal. Um, so we have this amazing suite area here where Jasmine and Renee and I share this hallway. So I see them every day and they're kind of, you know, my, my closest peeps here. Um, <laughs> where are you right now? Uh, Emily asks where I am right now. Emily, I'm in my dressing room. It's a little bit messy, so don't judge, but that's my dressing room. That's my dead plant. That's my elephant. I, um, this is my Piliza, my, my Eliza pillow that was made for me for Secret Santa. It's my Piliza. Um, did I know much about Eliza Hamilton before playing the part? No, I didn't, I didn't really know anything. Um, there's not a lot out there about her, so I had to do some, some digging, but it was very rewarding. Um, oh, hi from the cancellation line. Someone's on the cancellation line. Good luck, you guys, in the cancellation line. Um, sing something, please. <laughs> I don't know what I would sing right now for you guys. I am about to go sing for three hours, so um, any mishaps that have happened on stage, gosh, um, a lot of things have happened. You know, there was one time when I almost didn't come out with my lantern for burn, um, and it was terrifying because I thought, how am I going to play this scene without a lantern to burn the letter? So I had to kind of um, do some quick thinking, but then like at the split second of a moment um, our amazing props team just gave me this lantern that they got and they ran to get so I ended up being able to do it, but it was really scary um, Let's see Are you going on tour? I for Myself no um, Do I get nervous? I do get nervous. I do get nervous it comes in waves. Um, sometimes it's because I have people who are in my life who are very close to me or I looked up to growing up or um, mentors and I get nervous when I have to perform for them. Um, what's the best part about playing Eliza? I think the best part is that I, I get to live this entire woman's life in a matter of three hours. Um, there was a good question a little bit back. Oh, um, will I do a vocal warm up for you? Yeah. Bumblebee, 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 bumblebee. How does that one work? Uh, do I have my Tony's dress picked out? I just picked a dress. Um, have you ever broken character on stage? If so, when and how? There's been many moments where I've been very close to breaking character. Um, usually it's because there's just something that only I really find funny that I've noticed and I can't help but laugh about it. But also like there was one day when I, when I fell, when Angelica comes back, <laughs> I fell on stage, Angelica comes back from England and I go, uh, we go, Angelica, Eliza, and we hug each other, but I saw her and I like tripped on my dress and so I like couldn't get up and I kept tripping and tripping and tripping until I found her. Um, someone just told me I'm a bumblebee. Um, 
let's see. Oh gosh. You guys are so great, by the way. My nine-year-old daughter wants to know how old you are. <laughs> A lady never tells, my dear. What's my favorite song? I think um, my favorite song growing up was River by Joni Mitchell. Um, and also that whole album. I just loved listening to that in the car. What was going to the White House like from Anna? Um, it was amazing. It was so incredible to be able to have the opportunity to perform for the sitting president and for the first lady, who are huge fans of Hamilton. It was amazing. Um, <laughs> Ashley asked if I watch Scandal. I don't watch Scandal. Um, didn't Lynn make me laugh on stage once? Yes, many times, many times. My favorite book. I really enjoyed reading The Bell Jar. I feel like my inner feminist really loved that book growing up. Um, my pre-show ritual. Um, you know, I don't really have a whole a ritual, but I love drinking tea or coffee. Like, I, it just makes me feel like a little bit of like peace in the middle of the show. Um, this is a great question. Daniel Fisher, which breakfast topping do you consider yourself? Breakfast topping? Well, I feel like if I was a topping, I would probably be maple syrup. Is that, is that the answer you're looking for? Um, my favorite TV show is, um, gosh, there's so much that I've watched. I mean, I just started watching Chef's Table on Netflix. Um, like, there's the most beautifully shot images of food. It's just so incredible. Um, Coke or Pepsi? Gotta say Coke. Um, Colette asked if I ever strain my voice after screaming when Philip dies. Um, no, not usually. I feel like if, um, I'm pushing too hard that day, I will end up straining my voice. Um, but I don't necessarily always end up screaming the same way, so it kind of works out. <laughs> um, oh my gosh! Regan asks my favorite flavor of ice cream. Um, I think I would have to say butter pecan. I have old lady ice cream tastes. Fave, oh, um, favorite movie of all time. That's such a hard question. Um, I don't know that one yet. I'll have to get back to you on that. Um, <laughs> how's Rory doing? Hannah asked how Rory's, Rory's doing and Rory is amazing. He is so funny. And I love watching, watching when he's done with the king. He's just incredible. And also, we have this beautiful moment where we get to kind of hang out for a little bit in Act Two, and so it's just nice to check in with him, see how he's doing, and I've gotten to know him quite well. He's great. Do I like to draw? Love to draw. I used to paint when I was in high school. Um, hi from Australia. I've just been asked to beatbox from Kylie in Australia, so I'll give you a little sampling of some beatboxing. Ready? That's my beatboxing. <laughs> um, what else y'all got for me? Let's see. The first musical I ever saw was... Emoji is the one that has the two eyes that are like these that's smiling like this. It's my favorite one. I think I use that a lot. Um, learning to beatbox. So Shannon Rose, I'll tell you what, YouTube is a treasure, treasure trove of information where you can look up basically anything that you're trying to learn how to do and YouTube will tell you how to do it. So I just looked up beatboxing and I, that's how I learned. I would sit in my apartment um, my neighbors could probably hear me and they were like, what is that girl doing? But I would beatbox um, in the shower, I would beatbox or I'd beatbox at night before I went to bed. <laughs> and that's how I learned. Um, what did I get for my birthday? I got a lot of nice cards. I had a lovely barbecue. It was very lovely. Um, favorite social media? I think I like Instagram. Social media is hard for me. I'm a little bit 
flow with all that kind of stuff. So bear with me, you guys. Like this whole what's happening right now is blowing my mind. Like I kind of don't even understand it. So, um, but Instagram I like because I like taking pictures and I like seeing how people see the world. Um, what role do you want to play if cast non-traditional? Ooh, um, gosh, I feel like that's such a good question. I, any of them. I <laughs> um, let's see. Best concert I've ever seen. I went to Janelle Monet. Um, it was awesome. She's such an amazing performer. Um, let's see. What is your favorite genre of play? Tragedy, comedy. I like it all. I like it all. Um, favorite ice cream flavor? Peanut butter. <laughs> Butter pecan. So do you guys want to see Steve? Steve is here. I'm gonna let you guys see Steve really quick. Just wave to him. Ready? I just went to the dentist. So <laughs> um, he's bringing me dinner tonight. It's great. Um, favorite soup flavor? Hmm, mm. that's a tough question. I think I like butternut squash. Uh, I've never been to Germany. I would love to go to Germany one day. Um, <laughs> everyone is seeing you, so they're all going, Hi, Steve! Hello, everybody. <laughs> I'm uh, Chica's manservant bringing her food. <laughs> um, glorious, glamorous life. Let's see. Oh, Megan says that she loved you on Rescue Me. It's That's really, really exciting. Nice. Megan it's really nice. Told a long um, time so. <laughs> um, Let's see. Steve, what's your favorite song in the show? Burn. <laughs> pizza or tacos? Um, pizza. Well, I don't know. Could you make a taco pizza or a pizza taco? That would be kind of amazing. Um, if you were to swap with Renee, what scene song would you be most excited or nervous to perform? I love the part where she comes in and she goes, I know my sister like I know my own mind you will never find. Like every time she sings that I'm just like, yeah, you go get him, girl. So I feel like I, I would love to do that part. That'd be amazing. Um, hmm. Okay, I'm gonna answer one more question. Oh, Steve, someone just told you they love the soldiers play. Oh my gosh. Um, Happy seven years. Hi, Jack. Birthday. Hi, Jack. Favorite Disney movie? Okay, you guys, this is a big one. My favorite Disney movie the upcoming. would have to be Beauty and the Beast. Yeah, that's, pretty, that's probably what it is. Um, listen, I just wanna say, you guys are amazing, and I'm so grateful for all of your support and love. It's been really incredible. Um, so thank you, thank you so much for listening, and please keep keep um, keep uh, loving. It's just really great. Uh, have a good day. Bye, guys. <laughs>